Hello guys, today I want to talk about timestamps in Laravel and show you a difference between timestamps like created at and updated at automatically set by Laravel and the difference of using current timestamp from MySQL as database. And this is based on my tweet that I've retweeted, this one from Gurmandeep, which suggests that you can have timestamp field with use current. And there was a question, could you explain what is the difference between created at and added at in this case? I will explain with example. So I have created a new Laravel project, totally fresh, and add added at to the default users table. If we take a look at the documentation, what use current actually means, it sets timestamp column to use current timestamp as default value, current timestamp from MySQL. And this is important. If we take a look at the repository of Laravel framework itself, what is use current inside? It depends on what database driver you use. So there is different behavior for MySQL, for SQL Server, for SQLite and stuff like that. For example, for MySQL, it sets default value to the current, which is based on current timestamp MySQL function. So that is how it works if you add some field with use current. If we take a look at how created at and updated at works, it seems the same, but actually it is a bit different. The difference is time zones. So MySQL time zone and Laravel time zone may be different in your case. For example, on my local computer, I'm in Lithuania. Currently, I'm on GMT plus three time zone, which is locally time on my computer. But for Laravel project, the default time zone is UTC. So, so if we try to create a user, for that I will use Artisan Tinker, and then I will use the default factory from Laravel. So user factory create, it creates a user. And let's take a look at the database. Here's our database, and let's expand, create it at, update it at, and add it at fields. As you can see, create it at, and update it at 8 a.m. Add it at is 11 a.m., which means these are UTC times, this is the real time in my Lithuania on my computer currently, which is three hours difference. Because this under the hood uses carbon. So if we do, for example, echo now, what will be the time? 8 a.m., not 11 a.m. as I have currently locally, but 8 a.m. Why? To answer that, let's take a look at a trait inside of Laravel framework called has timestamps, which is used for all the models by default and there's a function called create set created at this one set created at it is called by update timestamps and the time for that is set as this fresh timestamp fresh timestamp looks like this return date now which uses carbon under the hood and then the time zone is set in the config app file time zone utc so all your created at and updated at values will be automatically in UTC. For example, if we change that to, let's call it Europe, London, for example, not sure how much is in London now, but let's try to restart the tinker for the changes and do user factory create. And as you can see, the time is 9 a.m., not 8 a.m. anymore. Generally, the topic of time zones is much broader, and I probably should have a few videos just around that or even mini course. But in this video, I wanted to show you the difference so you would understand what is the difference between setting your default values from MySQL with use current or current timestamp and the difference with Eloquent created at and updated at, which takes the time time zone from the Laravel config and not from MySQL time. If you want more tips, subscribe to the channel to get the videos, trying to shoot them daily, and all the other time is spent on shooting my courses at laravaldaily.teachable.com. 30 courses at the moment, there will be much more, so subscribe to that as well. See you guys in other videos.